Here, another good, good one. one. Want to hear a new one. one? Another new one? Okay. All right. You know, the, the boys set up a Jack and Rod show. Uh, it's their fake talk show. Yeah. And I guess they got a football expert guy. A guy wrote a book about football. And then they put Elliot Offen tapes on with the uh, guy to argue with him. Uh, and it's very funny. That's got to be good. Yeah, listen to this. And we're back on the Jack and Rod Show. It's Football Throwdown Thursday, and I'm your host, Rod Stiffington, with my co-host, Jack Mayoffer. And, Rod, today we have a very special guest on the phone for Totally Throwdown Football Thursday, Dr. Uh, Mike, Michael Yeses from Build a Better Athlete. How you doing, Dr. Yeses? Just great, thank you. So, Doctor, give us a brief background on the book on how to build a better athlete. Well, too often the uh, training of an athlete, is, or especially a football player, revolves around strength. Well, we do have an expert on the phone, right, Jack? Yeah, we we actually have our uh, our expert, Mr. Football, Elliot Offen. Hey, Elliot, are you there? How are you this morning, big fella? Okay, so, uh, Elliot, go ahead and give Dr. Yeses your picks. We got Dallas hey. plus one. Jacksonville has the fucking weakest, right? The fucking weakest offense, and we have a healthy Julius Jones and Malian Barbara, two very healthy running backs, right? Yeah, okay, that, that's fine, but you know, I don't go into too much on the prediction side. That's great for a bar, bar, room, uh, bar room discussion. All right, so wait a minute. Hello, hello. I didn't fucking, <laughs> right, I didn't, I didn't fucking finish yet, right? I didn't fucking finish yet. The Jacksonville Jaguars, right? They had the least scoring fucking offense in the nation, right? <sighs> Well, I bet your opinion. Go for it. Right? I got the conviction. I'm going to back it up, right? All right, good. Back it up. And the proof will be in the pudding when we read the paper on Monday. So it Listen, I don't give a fuck what you say. Somebody told you whether you have a fucking cock or a tongue, right? Somebody told you whether you have a fucking cock or a tongue. Well, what, what are you trying to say? <laughs> have you ever had a cock in your pharynx and your larynx or in your trachea? Hey, I don't want to get down to your level. If you can't use words to explain where the hell you're coming from, and you got to keep cursing all over the place, that shows you you don't you don't know what the hell you're talking about. It's, I just asked funny. you if you ever had a cock. Forget about a penis. Have you ever had a cock in your thorax and your larynx or in your trachea? <clears throat> well, you know you're yelling so loud, I can't even understand you. Listen, I'm Elegant Delia, and I do whatever the fuck I want, and if anybody fucking gets in my way, I fucking take their fucking eyes out, right? Gangster style! Oh, for Christ's sake, get off your kick, will you? Bring All right, that, that, that's better, you fucking bedlamite, hermaphrodite, and troglodyte, that's better! This conversation's not going anyplace. You're typically just an, a real asshole. It's time to say goodbye. Adios. <laughs>